Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel Ekham Family. My name is Mary Ann and today I'm going to show to you guys our winter squash garden. And if you are not yet a subscriber, please subscribe and you can comment below the video. You can hit the like button if you like this video. Hi everyone, this is our winter squash garden for 2019. This is our first year to plant winter squash so we are so excited this garden is next to our chicken coop here most of our garden is next to our house so let's go let's find some squash so in this garden we have several kinds of winter squash we have the watham butternut squash we have also the acorn squash both the table king acorn and table queen acorn i have also some delicata squash here thelma sander squash uh, what else i have also the honey baby butternut squash uh, pilgrim butternut squash so oh i have also spaghetti squash here so let's see if we can find some fruits here I'm going to use this stick so I can pull the leaves out so we can see the fruits. So here, I see already butternut squash. That two in there, they're butternut squash. And I have, next to that two, there's another two here too. Oops, the leaves. That's butternut squash. So this butternut squash, the maturity day is around 110 days. So it takes time for them to mature so they can store in the winter. I think you can store them six months or more. So let's keep going here. The, this garden, I cannot walk in the middle. I just have to walk at the sides because... The vines are just crazy there in the middle. It's hard to walk. I'm not walking there in the middle. So let's walk here the side. Let's see if we can find more. And in this garden, I think I have at least 50 plants of winter squash. All winter squash. Oh, I see another one. That's more butternut squash. Oh, I see down here below. That's another butternut squash. Here we go. And there's another one there. Butternut squash. And in this area, I see spaghetti squash. That's spaghetti squash. Uh, let's find more here. Oh, I see that's tiny squash. Spaghetti. And I'm not sure if you can see, but that is another spaghetti squash and here's the chickens they think I have some goodies for them here they are they're staying next to the coop because it's been a hot day today so they're cooling themselves uh, next to the coop now have to continue looking for more squash Oh, I see something here. Look at this squash, guys. This one. This greenish, greenish squash. I think this is called the honey baby. If one butternut squash. That one there. It's a butternut, but I think this is hybrid, that green one. And next to it is just a kind of butternut, maybe wasam. What some butternut? There's 
for another uh, Thermo Sander squash. Let's see if I can show you that without the Pokemon leaf. Yeah, that's Thermo Sander squash. There are two of them next to each other. Yeah, look. And there's another one there. That's another Thermo Sander squash. So, we have a lot of squash. Winter squash. I decided to plant this winter squash this year so I don't have to uh, can a lot of vegetables because I used to can a lot of string beans, uh, beets, cucumbers, but this, this year I'm not going to do canning. So this winter squash, I don't have to can them because you can store them in the cellar for at least six months, especially the butternut they stay you know you can store them long except if they have bruises or damage they're going to go rot we have three plants here of bet bitter melon and i see a small bitter melon here where are you bitter melon here we go here's the bitter melon that's another ampalaya I'm excited for that and there's another more there look yeah so here in the section one two three three fruits I think we have the Indian kind here bitter melon the Chinese bitter melon and the white bitter melon so the last couple of years we always had that the Chinese kind of bitter melon I haven't tried the Indian and the white so this year we have one of each so and here's a uh, that sunflower volunteers from last year again another sunflower are so tall i'm not sure that's almost 12 feet or 10 feet here in the middle of the garden i'm going to show to you more fruits look at that they're both the three of them are Thelma Sander squash. And I see more here guys. I see more here. Oops, I'm trying not to step on the plants. But it's hard to walk here. Oh, that's a butternut squash. And more squash, look. Keep going here. More squash. Look. Oh my. I think we have a lot here. That's good. Because I plant a lot of here. So that's more butternut. Butternut. Oh, I see a big one here. Two of them. I think this is the hybrid kind here. Maybe this is the pilgrim butternut. Because I plant the hybrid in this section here. Uh, the pilgrim butternut can go, I think, three pounds. That one. And I'm going to show to you uh, acorn. Oh, acorn squash. This is acorn. That's the dark. One here, this one here. It's acorn, it's acorn. But this one here is the this one is the delicata winter squash. Okay, look at that's pretty. We have more delicata squash there. Somewhere on the other side, but I don't wanna get closer there because there is yellow jacket in there. They have a nest there. I got stung already three times. And I don't wanna get tongue again it hurts it hurts me the whole day and whole night that's another uh, acorn that's acorn here it's hard to look here 
All right, everyone. There's more acorn and more big squash in the middle, but it's just hard to go in there in the middle. I'm not sure if you can see, but there's a big one there. So this is it, guys, our winter squash garden. So the next time I'm going to show this when you harvest. So very excited. And hopefully you guys are doing some gardening. You know, you don't have to have a big land to have a garden. You can start in a big pot and have some kind of like say a tomato plant in there or it's a cucumber plants in a pot so thanks everyone for watching our video and hopefully you like it please don't forget to subscribe it's really the sun is really bright thank you again everyone see you see you in the next video Bye and God bless.